gene transfer process there are three different trans transfer process like the transformation transduction and conjugation so let's see what happened in three different processes what happens in the transformation uh, transformation is the direct uptake process from outside the bacterial cell and when the bacteria uh, uptakes the external DNA those DNA incorporates into the bacterial chromosome and if there is a gene inside that fragmented DNA that come from outside then that gene actually expresses inside the bacteria so this type of uptake only happens when the bacterial cell is a competent cell how does how, how does it mean by the competent cell competence is the ability of a cell to take up extracellular dna from its environment so those type of cell who actually accept the outside dna are called the competent cell there are two types of transformation the natural one and the artificial one the natural transformation happens when each uh, in the natural environment and it does not have any uh, human interference but the artificial uh, transformation we uh, do for our own purpose in the laboratory uh, transformation works based with the DNA that are closely related species and for this transformation the bacteria need a type of uh, protein or receptor uh, on the cell membrane like the type 4 pili and type 2 secretion uh, system and also need the DNA translocase complex all of these protein help to uh, go inside the bacterial cell for the fragmented DNA and this type of DNA uptake is uh, generally non sequence specific that's mean that uh, the sequence uh, whatever be the sequence of the fragmented DNA is so there is no problem the fragmented DNA uh, goes inside the bacterial cell same type of transformation when happens in eukaryotic cell then it is called transfection and next what is transduction transduction is the process uh, which DNA is transferred from one bacterium to, to another bacterium by a virus okay let's see what happened this virus uh, infect the bacteria we call it type uh, just first bacteria when this virus infect into the bacteria then the viral DNA and the viral DNA uh, replicates inside the bacteria and it produces a lot of uh, viral replicate uh, replicates of the chromosome and then this chromosome when uh, insert into the new uh, viral head particle then some of the bacterial chromosome added to this viral chromosome and after lysis of the um, this bacteria the virus particle then infect the second bacteria this is second bacteria so when this virus infect the second bacteria this virus have the previous bacteria's DNA fragment so this time this DNA fragment just incorporated into the second bacterial chromosome 
and this is how the transduction happen and this is the process that does not need any physical contact like the conjugation or other processes because this happened through the viral system and since this is going through the viral system so dns cannot destroy the dna that is transferred to first bacteria to second bacteria next the conjugation um, this the conjugation happens with uh, the two bacteria first is called the donor bacteria and the second is called the recipient bacteria this is the donor bacteria it has a uh, f plasmid f plasmid means the fertility plasmid the bacteria which has a f plasmid it can produce a pilus uh, through uh, pilus one bacteria can make a tunnel to the second bacteria that's mean the donor bacteria and the recipient bacteria when the pilus makes a tunnel this plasmid makes uh, a single stranded copy from the double stranded and then single stranded uh, plasmid go through the tunnel to the second recipient bacteria this happen with the help of relaxome and transferasome so after uh, transferring the single stranded uh, plasmid uh, both bacteria can produce the double stranded triplicate from the single stranded plasmid so now these bacteria which, which did not have the ability to uh, Uh, produce the pilus now it can produce the pilus so now this bacteria can transmit it f plasmid to the another bacteria by this pilus so this is the process of uh, conjugation uh, the pilus is typically 6 to uh, 7 nanometer in diameter and pili are uh, two types conjugative and the type 4 and the pilus is composed of uh, enormous amount of protein which is called pilin it looks like this and this type of conjugation can uh, happen between the bacteria of a different type of species